think a lot of the problems that we're seeing with heretics, I was talking to Goober, where you end up getting hit by these massive amounts of damage. You can get chunked out thanks to the rend, resetting off of another creep. It becomes very hard, difficult to play against. Oh my four. god, Wonder is gonna get burned down! He wasn't ready for it, we weren't ready for it! Adam! Oh, I feel like he knows. Look at, he's just he's just staying right on the edge. He doesn't know. He didn't see it coming. Move forward, Q back, instant, easy smash there, fall up on the bear stance. Get more of the ramp stance, excuse me. Adam taking out, nice counter punch. Coming in for the side of Team Heretics. Who are they gonna try to turn on? Instantly it's gonna be Yanko's. Yanko's just gonna have to ult to try and disengage. Wonder now firing back. Ezreal coming in, good damage, good follow up. Perks from downtown. Duke now coming into the play. He still has the shockwave up and available. Marking him up, boom, combo baby. Sheo and Nuke working beautifully together. Perks just trying to lay down a little bit more damage, but he already has to run for his life. The sapling will not finish Sheo off, and BDS with a double kill on the top side of the map. They thought they had Perks with the top rope, but it was a trap. Trade of summoner spells thus far. LeBron backing off, of course, only level five has Flash. Taking his time, will not get stunned up. Flash might not save his life, though. Needed to do it just a bit sooner. Flack is grabbing the return kill here. Nicely done by the Heritage spotlight. I was about to say, you're getting played on bot side. Ice is getting a rumble ult. That's not where you want to be. Body block at least getting one. Instant ulti now coming down. That's the equalizer lock on the backside just to give a bit more health over to Flack. And LeBron now going to be in trouble. Stepping off to the side just does manage to find the kill. Wonder running. Team Heretics running. Magical journey out to safety, but BDS bully their way. Not really much of a play to be made here for Team Heretics. Oh, Labra. Flash over the wall, though. Big play for LeBron. Just deletes the bard. And now Wonder has to run for the hills. Are they going to fire anything else out? No. Happy to have just a single pick there. Team Heretics fishing, but kind of caught overextending. Now Sheo gets to move in and take all the vision that he wants, knowing he has the man advantage. Sheo, ulti could be big. That's the equalizer coming down, but they're just body blocking the Qs coming in from Perks of the Wall, and they do not matter. Sheo still standing. Zin Zhao, oh baby, but a two-man lockup coming in from Kaiser is big. Sheo now running. Keep your eyes on ice in the back line. The piercing arrow has to hit, and it does. Nuke still stepping forward. Wonder go. Timing here has to be good. Kaiser ready to go for the wall. Nuke caught out a key pick. That could be it. Shut down. What else can Team Heretics get on the back side of that? Wonders in the mid lane. Can he collapse? Can Team Heretics just force a Baron? BDS seem unshaken. It's just gonna slip. Hitting the targets that it needs to. But the knockup is there. Adam going over and looking to make a burn. Sheo coming out on top. Wonder going through, but the knockback is there from Sheo. Stopping any follow up damage. And BDS, they don't care if it's 4v5 because Nuke's there just in time. And now it might just be BDS's Baron. BDS just want to watch Heretics burn, and they do exactly that. And they and are trying to lock him up. Kaiser going to find the stun, but Ice is untouched over the wall. Kaiser is dead, no doubt in my mind, as Ice is on a rampage. LeBron body blocking, making sure Flacken can't get into the fight. Now it's just Yanko has to run for the hills. BDS. Ezreal, they will be able to clear oh the way, but a beautiful awesome. equalizer. BDS just walking in and focusing down the tower. Yankos goes in with the Twisted Advance, but it's not nearly enough. Sheo immediately ult, stopping any potential follow-up damage. And I feel like this single champion just hard counters Team Heretic's hopes. Starting to do a bit more. Equalizer now coming down. Flacken in trouble. We'll just get cut out by Sheo. Yankos on the run. BDS cleaning up in the fight. One last desperate attempt from Team Heretic's. Heartfelt effort, but not enough here in the game one. We'll need to look to recover in this best of three coming into game two, and it's a full off fountain dive. We'll at least get a kill back. BDS off to a commanding start. <laughs> Welcome back to the LECS BDS grabs a convincing win against Heretics here in game one. Came prepared because for me, seeing Adam on Rumble is That's not huge. something I expected to see in 20. Rob, heck flashing in. It's going to be the hookup. Now it's going to be a 2v3 right off the bat because Rob is going to go down with the Ignite Zark taking out the flak and flak and knock back to the wall. One kick kill, but now the bars gets to start to take over. At least another one traded back. Body blocks coming in as long as they block the ball breaker. Maybe Ice can live. Ice flashing out to safety. Flash forward from Yankos to seal the deal. And now looking to turn it back. If at first you don't succeed, or partially succeed, try, try again. LeBron walking up, there's really no way out of this. Kaiser should just be dead here. Knock back into the waiting arms of Ice, and... BDS just make that look free. Team Heretics over eager on the bottom side. Had more members in route, but not nearly enough in the area. Caught the wrong target. LeBron trying to make it out to safety, but Team Heretics with an excellent counter punch on the bottom side. Have to be careful about overcommitting here. Yankos could be in trouble. Knock back into the tower. No minion waves there to tank him up. Big misstep from the buy, but no. Flacken tanking flawlessly to keep his jungler standing. I cannot believe Flacken got out of range there. I was convinced. Punch. Excellent ball breaker to interrupt initially. Now the alt follow up to make sure that nothing else connects. Ice going to be in trouble. Kaiser now following up. Blitzcrank. Hook. Pull back. They've locked him in. Flacken now getting pulled away, but LeBron going to be the one in trouble. Team Heretics taking over on the bottom side of the map. Next ball breaker. Kaiser going to take aggro here initially, ready to move out if he needs to. LeBron going to get taken down. Sheo on the way in, but nah. The Ren coming through. Team Heretics. Solid gold lead, mostly because of the kill here. You can see a small CS lead as well. 10 in his favor. 
Nuke trying to bait. Nice pullback there. Shao on the way in. Surely no way that Perks can make it out of this one. Throws out the clone, but they've got time to kill both. <laughs> bad. That was very, very bad. Hook comes in on the bottom side. His team, though. Gonna try to help him find a bit more redemption as Flacken jumps in for a quick kill. Kill on the top side, potentially on Adam as well. Adam flashing in, instantly shutting down Yankos, and Perks might be in trouble too. That's a red buff that is a very fast Garen. Perks, I think, a little bit over eager. Blast coning over, has the Rocket Bell, has the ult, he needs to get to the back side, but Shao says not today. But who will get the Drake? LeBron for the setup, Shao still in the pit. Ice off to the side, taking down Yankos. BDS dismantling Team Heretics in the exchange, getting the objective, and Perks is now in trouble. Wonder trying to fire back. Two dead on the side of BDS, two dead on the side of Team Heretics, but it is BDS who take the objective. Shao shut down the duo that heretics were trying to play around. There's just no way out. Too much CC. Shao can try to follow up. Garen split pushing on the bottom side. Team heretics, do they want to keep the ball rolling and turn their sights to the Baron? I mean, you don't have Garen here. Garen going to use his Q to try and speed himself up to get in towards the Baron area, but not feeling confident to do so. It's like nothing's really going to happen here. Objective ready to go down. Shao ready to body block. Yanko's going to go to the pit. He's going to take one away. Soul point for Team Heretics. Knock back immediately on a Rob. Adam in the backside. Just trying to one shot Flacken, but the ulti. Kaiser doing everything he can to keep Flacken alive, and they'll do it. They keep their man standing. Wonder getting ushered out on the backside of the fight, but he is still up. Two members down on the side of BDS. Objective. Vision. Wonder ready to go. Win. Knock back, not gonna connect onto anybody. That is crucial. Baron should just be Team Heretics. BDS are looking for the follow-up fight, but already the knockback into the wall. They're trying to finish it. They're going against it against the Callista against all odds. Yankos might steal a dragon, but Shao gets on now coming in from Nuke. TP now coming in as well. No interruption. Man advantage in the fight for the side of Team Heretics, but a nice start with the immediate shutdown as LeBron gets the kill credit onto Yankos. Perks trying to kick things off, but he only manages to lock down two. Adam gets pulled back into the back line. He should just get deleted, but he keeps on spinning for just a little bit too long. Ice is untouched. Nuke is untouched. Shockwave on to two, and down go BDS. It's a triple for Ice. There's no real follow-up. Perks already spotted out on the wave. Shayon now stepping forward. Instant ult to knock up two bars. All now going to follow. Perks cleansing out, but he just has ult to get out to safety. BDS. They get this fight. Yankos just gets to run. They can try to turn back on a LeBron, but here comes Nuke. Eyes on the Oriana. Eyes on the potential Shockwave. Instant follow-up coming in from Adam. Instant two-man Shockwave. BDS. Cleaning house, nowhere left for Team Heretics to go. Shao says, wonder you can keep your life. We're gonna take the base. I mean, Heretics will have one more in them as they move down to the lower bracket with this win, but BDS, they wanna make this a resounding victory here. Absolutely do, no shockwave left, but BDS, simply too powerful. Game two, much more back and forth, much closer, but at the end of the day, BDS just playing better in the fight. It's out executing, out performing. They're going to keep on the upper bracket as they take down Team Heretics with a relatively clean 2-0. I mean, Labrov putting away his mouse.